राम कौशल्यानंदीताय श्रीराम सार्वभौम दखायात हरिरामना तनिष्ठ राम हरिदास ठाकुर इन श्री चैतन्य महाप्रभु that has all the other avatars inside of you. That's why in Kali Yuga, all the other avatars, they enter there. Avatarushar Yuga Avatar. Imagine avatarsha. That means essence of all avatars, not the best avatars. Is essence of all avatars. Haridas <coughs> Thakur is saying that's why everyone, all the devotees, maybe. They are worshiping different priests. Some will worship Narayana. Some will worship Some will worship Prabhu Ramchandra. Some will worship Sri Vishnu Bhagavan. With their mood, they can feel their mystery in Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. That is why all the devotees from the different Easterns, they are the near associates of Sri Krishna Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, like Murari Gupta. Murari Gupta, he was the worshipper of Prabhu Ramchandra. After Sriman Mahaprabhu advised, then also he could not change his history. He tried. Because all the devotees, they complained to Sriman Mahaprabhu, Oh Prabhu, you are advising everyone to worship Krishna for Kali Yuga. Krishna is everything. We have to chant Mahamantra. But Murari Gita is not following your words. Murari Gupta is not following your words. Prabhu is everything. But then also, he wanted to show his dedication. How we have to respect, how we have to offer our sraddha, our dedication, how we have to fix our mind with our Easter. Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, he wanted to show everyone this. That's why he called Murari Gupta. When he came to him, he asked, Oh Murari, everybody is complaining about you. Oh. No. What? Maybe some apologize is there? Yes. In Kali Yuga, we have to worship Krishna. We have to chant Mahamantra, Harinam Mahamantra. But we are not following my words. We are not following the scriptures. We are worshiping Prabhu Ramchandra. We are chanting the Ramanama. Why? He was speechless. Murari Gupta was speechless because he is feeling Prabhu Ramchandra in Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. 
So Prabhu Ramchandra he is saying to him that you have to worship Krishna. <laughs> You have to leave me. You have to stop loving me. It was very difficult, very problematic for him to change this moment. Prabhu continued, Oh, Brahmi. Okay, until now, what you have done, what you have did, no problem. Just from tomorrow, start worshiping Krishna. Start to chant Mahamantra. You know what was happening? From that time, Murad Gupta stopped to come to Mahamantra. After three, four days, Mahaprabhu, he knows what is happening with him. After three, four days, the devotees, they asked to Mahaprabhu, Oh Prabhu, Muradnukta is not coming. What is happening? Then Prabhu just act in front of the devotees that he doesn't know anything. Oh, really? Muradnukta is not coming? Maybe he is. Go to him. And one devotee, he went there to the house of Murad Gupta. And he had seen that Murad Gupta he became very thin, his crying, said head. Oh Murari, what's happened with you? Oh what was there? So the devotee came and he explained everything to Mahaprabhu. Then Mahaprabhu, he called him again. When, when Muradhyamsa came to him, he asked, Oh Muradhyamsa, what's happening with you? Any problem? Then he explained his truths, Oh Prabhu, in front of me you were my Ramachandra. I am worshipping you not as Krishna, not as Gauranga. I am worshipping you as Prabhu Ramachandra. So my Prabhu Ramachandra, he advised me that I have to worship Krishna. How I can stop loving my Prabhu? It was a great problem for me. So I thought maybe they have some Aparadha offenses or any sin, pop. So I read this price sheet, which said that, said my hair is But then also, whenever I try to meditate about Krishna, you, my Prabhu, Prabhu Ramachandra will come and talk to me. Whenever I try, try to chant Mahamantra, only Ram Ram is coming. What I should do? So that's why I leave everything. Drinking water, taking food. I leave everything. And I decide to leave my body in that way. Because I cannot follow your words. Then Prabhu. He embraced Murari Gupta and he said, Oh Murad, I wanted to show you this dedication to everyone. <coughs> you are not to worship Krishna. Yes, you should continue worshiping Brahma Ramachandra. Because you are the greatest servant of Brahma Ramachandra. To Ram Das. Then he wrote this name Ram Das in the forehead of Murari Gupta. So for Murari Gupta, he is Kaushalya Nandan, that means son of Mother Kaushalya. 
Prabhupada said. That is why I am feeling that is a statue to say, you know, the Asadya Prabhu, that is why I am feeling Prabhu Ramchandra also is there. That is why here Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu has Sri Dharma around. Hari, Shamabhuche Hari Ramon, Te Avatar. अथवा एक और नाम बहिन होता है। ये वो हरिदास्तक को भी सही। He is telling all the darkness of ignorance, he is telling all inauspicious objects from our heart. That's why he is sorry. But here हरिदास्तक को भी सही। He is not telling only something from the root is sorry. He also stole by his own sweetness. Because he was attracted by his own sweetness, by his own beauty. That's why he appeared here as Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. <coughs> so when his sweetness, when he lost everything, by his own sweetness, by his own beauty. That's why here he is again. Next story. Shabhave Hurya Chitta Kurma Kriti Bhairo Ataeva Harinam Jagate Ghoshilo Harinamel Gurho Arto Kurilo Prakash आगमो निगमो जार नहीं जाने आश आ एक गुर हो अर्थ आश्रय हार सुनो हो श्रीपाद शर्व अर्थ तत्पुषार महामंत्रे शुलनाम तीन नाम शार तीन नाम हुई ते शुलो नामे रोबिस्ता शौभावे हुरिया चित्त कुर्मा कृत हुई If you just see the life of Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, <coughs> Nama Prachar, all the devotees, Uddhar, like Jagai Madhai, Kaji, everything he did, just the first part of his life. He was here in this material world only for eight years, isn't it? And when he was 24, <coughs> he accepted sannyas. Very soon, he finished all his duty and he gave all the responsibilities for preaching, for Blessings all the jivas, all the grihasthas to Sri Bhagavatananda. Then he entered in, in his own bhajan, you can say, testing Sri Radha Prayer. So, after he finished, when he took sannyas, when he went to Nilaja, then he started to test his Radha Prabhu, practice about Prima. Pratri Vilap Pari Sharubir Kantradhari Avishe Apama Bhav Kahino Ghani. He will explain all his words from his heart to his very near associates. Like Sharutamta, like Raya Ramananda. So every night, when you will get this high stage of prema, of Radha prema, that time he will embrace Sharutamadar 
to embrace Brahmananda Rai and he will say everything, O Sharoka. Now I am feeling this. Sometimes you will get this Ashta Shakti Bhav, the special mood of Parema. Eight kind of special mood of Parema. And in this eight kind of moods, there has something very surprising. Sometimes Granth Shete, that means the joy will be loose. It becomes very long. <clears throat> Sometimes all these organs, these hands, legs, will go inside of him. That time he look like the trockers, kurmas. So when he started to test this high prema or prasa prema, he will get this almost and it was happening because he lost everything by his own sweetness. His own potential stole everything from him. Even consciousness. So it was happening again and again with him. That's why he named as Hari. Haridas Thakur, he got some essence of Mahamantra. You know, there has 16 names, 32 letters, but there has only three names more important. Hari, Krishna, Rama. By this three names, everything, all the Aishwarya's come out. Next Hari, Sakkhat Sri Hari Palo Chaitanya Goshai Ataeva Hari Vi Tadnangai. The grammatical form, when you are coming Hari, in Sanskrit, that time, you have to say Hari, for Kali. This form for Hari, for Kali is Hari. Haridas Thakur is saying that Swam Bhagavan, he himself, he appeared for all the Kali Jeevas to teach them, to protect them. That's why he is Hari. Rama Sri Nityananda Gosai Rama Avatar Teho Rama Namo Tar Vidita Samshara Now Haridas Thakur Now he is explaining the truths If you worship Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu alone Then you will never get his blessings. You will never achieve prema. You will never achieve the highest test of Mahamantra. Because this everything, this all you will get from Sri Nitanya. In my Mahamantra chanting, Ardhas Thakur is saying, in my Mahamantra chanting, I am not only feeling Sri Krishna Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, Because you cannot separate them. They are together. Sri Chaitanya Nityananda. They are always together. That's why in Rama I am feeling Sri Nityananda, who is really giving us all the Kali Jiva, this highest pleasure of Parama, highest pleasure of Mahama. It was spreaded by Nityananda. 
if you will not get blessings from him, then never you will get this blessings from Mahamantra. Mahamantra will not appear in your heart. Because according to scripture, Vitananda Prabhu is the root of Bhajana tree, main root of Bhajana tree. Bhaji Nityanandam Bhajana Tarukandam. Kandam means the root, main root. If you cut the main root of one tree, any plant, then it will not alive. It will die very soon. Maybe you can give so many food, so many water to them. But if you cut the root, main root, very soon it will die. So if you have no blessings from Nityananda, if you are not really worshipping Nityananda, if you are not feeling attachment with Nityananda, that means your bhajana tree very soon it will die. You are cutting the main root of bhajana tree. That's why he answered me, yes, Srivat. Srinitananda Prabhu is here, Mula Shankarshan, is the avatar of Mula Shankarshan. That's why I am feeling in this realm, Prabhu Nitananda is there, together with my Prabhu, Sri Krishna Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. I will worship Sri Krishna Chaitanya Mahaprabhu by His blessings. I can worship. I will chant Mahamantra. Nitai Chad will send me the prayer. Dedication. That is why. First of everything, we need these blessings from Nitananda. Mahamantra. Then we can fix our mind with Mahamantra. Otherwise, maybe we'll chant Mahamantra, our mind will be traveled everywhere, so many places. Sometimes we'll forget to chant. After some time, we'll feel this. We recognize, oh, I stopped Mahamantra. Again we start. It will happen when you have no blessings from your time. So first of everything, Haridas Thakur, he said that first of everything, you need these blessings. That's why whenever I am chanting Mahamantra, I am feeling both of them is there. Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu and Sri Nityananda Mahaprabhu together. Krishna. Krishna Amshi Avatir Namati Kyos Kandho. Te Karan Krishna Nam Bhujhavan Bandho. Madan Tare Shoranam Charinam Shar Charinam Hite Panchatat Tera Prachar Shayam Sri Krishna Hai Chaitanya Mushai Atoe Vatar Nam Krishna Parigai Parashraj Mahabhav Dui Yakaru Atoe Sri Chaitanya Krishna Rashi Now, Haridas Thakur is saying Mahamantra in his own way. From his feelings, Krishna, Krishna, Rama, Rama. Together. Not the way, what is written there. He is going with his statue of Prema.
श्री चैतन्य महाप्रभु ही कृष्ण इन दिस महामंत्र द मेन नेम इज थ्री हरे कृष्ण राम बट ऑल इज आई एम थिंकिंग श्री कृष्ण श्री चैतन्य महाप्रभु राम इज नित्यानंद दैट्स व्हाई फ्रॉम दिस सिक्सटीन नेम always and bring this four name hari krishna hari ram krishna himself is sri chaitanya mahaprabhu that's why i am calling him i am chanting his name as krishna you know why i am feeling like this in this form रसराज कृष्ण इज रसराज क्राउन ज्वेल ऑफ ऑल रस एंड श्रीमती राधरानी इस महाभाव स्वरूप में क्राउन ज्वेल ऑफ ऑल भाव मोक्ष बट हि when both of them together in this one form sri chaitanya mahaprabhu so you will find the rasaraj the crown jewel of all rasa is there and at the same time mahabhava crown jewel of all the mus bhav rama बलराम अवतार निताय ठाकुर अतएव राम नाम प्रेम रसपुर अथवा जतेष्ट करे सप्रेष्ठ रमन नित्यानंद राम दे घाय भक्त राम रमाशक्ति श्री अनंद दार अवतार अतएव नित्यानंद राम नाम सार डिस्ट्रीब्यूट prema bhav to everyone that's why i am feeling ram is nitananda ram not any other one and you know this rama shakti rama shakti means rama means shrimati radha why nitananda इस राम इस रमा शक्ति इज द शक्ति ऑफ श्रीमती राधा रानी बिकॉज ही इज अनंत मंजरी ऑल्सो ही इज अनंत मंजरी ऑल्सो दैट्स वाई सी नोज ही नोज एज अनंत मंजरी हाउ टू प्लेज श्री चैतन्य महाप्रभु हाउ टू प्लीज श्री कृष्ण हाउ टू प्लीज श्री मित्रा सो इफ यू वॉन्ट टू प्लीज ऑल ऑफ देम श्री कृष्ण श्री चैतन्य श्री राधारण देन फर्स्ट ऑफ एवरीथिंग यू हैव टू प्लीज श्री मित्रा ओनली बाई हिज प्लेसिंग only by her blessing as ananga manjari you can achieve this all prema <coughs> hari now haridashtha ko we send about others with the devotees not all the devotees i mention hari means advait hari naam dait bhakti samshane अतएव हरिणाम तुम्हारा खाना 
क्या आता है दोनों क्या हरे मीन्स हर महाविष्णु हर मीन्स महाविष्णु एट द सेम टाइम ड्यूरिंग द बेस्ट इज फ्रॉम डिवोट इज ऑल्सो कुछ महाविष्णु is the part of swam bhagwan personal form and also the devotee so we just think about devadi that mahadev who is also mahavishnu scripture said that vishnu manam jatha sambhu Amongst all the Vaishnavas, Devadhidev Mahadev is the greatest one. So, if you go to Devadhidev Mahadev, you will not, he will not give you any other things but Krishna Bhakti. But sometimes the demons. They also worship Ashuras. They also worship Devadhi the Mahadev. <coughs> But they ask for other things. When his devotees, great devotees, when he is uh, full of heart of prema, so why these Ashuras? They ask this power, wealth from him because they took darshan of the Bhagwan and the Mahadev with their qualities, with tamaguna. If you wear one red dress, then you can see everything is red. Originally, that is not red. But if you use one red glass for your eyes, then in front of you everything will be red. So when we will see some things with our qualities, rotom ye rotom chhi, one day will come. The jewel, he knows, he can recognize the jewels. other jewels so we are always searching some things with our qualities we are seeing some things with our qualities that's why everyone has such different vision maybe some saying for me is very beautiful for other one is not so really very beautiful With our mood, when we are seeing some things, it will manifest in front of us with our qualities. Guna. That's why the form of Devadhi Shiva is as a devotee, greatest devotee, Vaishnavam Jatasama, Vaishnavam. If we go to him, then he will give you Krishna Bhakti. But if you worship him with this tamas guna, then your mind will change. That's why it was said in the suras. Here, Mahavishnu is Advaita Parama, who is greatest Vaishnava. If you want to praise Sri Nityananda, Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, then you have to go to them through the devotees. Greatest devotees, who is very near of them. So here, Mahavishnu is very near of them. That's why I am feeling this Hari as Mahavishnu Sri Advaita Chandra.
হরিয়া আমি দোহাল উদিয়া নগর অতই অতই হরি নাম হইল তোমার বাই হিস কলি শ্রী চৈতন্য মহাপ্রভু শ্রী নিত্যানন্দ প্রভু নিত্যানন্দ প্রভু হি বোর্ন ইন অ্যানাদার প্লেস এক চক্র But according to his Lila, he will follow his Lila. He appeared as this form as Nithananda in Navati when he met with Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. And it was happened by Advaita Asantya. Before Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, he appeared at Ras Thakur. He used to chant Mahamantra same way. Vandak, Mahamshikya. Vandak, that means 100,000 whisper and 100,000 like Kirtan, a very loud. So he got punishment from the Muslim kings. very strong punishment and that time everywhere all the smarters they are performing their activities they are offering this boat to the dangos tantrics so to see this all Haridas Thakur, he asked to Advaita Asalya, oh Prabhu, what will happen with this Kali people? What will happen with this Kali people? Because they have no desire for Mahamatra, 